Tim then, as we went through the process, started to think that he'd like them to be more humanoid in something from a child's nightmare, um, but something that was like a person. And he made these images of this kind of very tall, emaciated figure uh, with, without a face. That was a kind of starting point for the design. We went from what was basically a, a monster, um, which wasn't very humanoid at all, to a very human-looking figure, to the idea that these were, you know, that they weren't actually very far away from the humans that they once were. They just become emaciated, they'd lost their features, they were still wearing some of the clothes that they were wearing when they were humans. And so we had this thing where the creature became almost human, but just enough monstrosity to, for it to be scary. And so it ended up with very sharp teeth, very shallow eyes and unhealthy looking skin. Uh, it's, always, it's always important to have that kind of, uh, that sort of basis in physical reality for these kind of effects. <laughs> 